Russia suffered terrible losses in village of Borovaya, Kharkiv region. The loss ratio was 10 to 1. The ratio of losses between Russia and the Ukrainian armed forces at Borovaya in the Kharkiv region, where the enemy is conducting active assault operations, is 10 to 1. Both wounded and killed. Such figures were voiced by the commander of the terror unit as part of the 3rd Separate Assault Brigade, Nikolai Volokov in an interview with Radio NV, informing about the situation near the village of Borovaya. He noted that the situation on the section of the front, where the 3rd Separate Assault Brigade is holding the line, is tense all the time. The enemy is simultaneously and almost daily concentrating its forces here and testing the strength of the Ukrainian fighters' defense. The situation is tense. No threat has disappeared anywhere. On the contrary, I would say, that it is constantly growing. Russia can afford to simultaneously accumulate and put pressure in different directions. The goal is simple. In order to realize the accumulated potential, it is necessary to identify a point for use. Therefore, they constantly check. Unfortunately, they have enough resources for this. And this resource of constant pressure on the front looks like platoons and companies. A very large number of Russians go forward and die, Volokov said. According to him, the reserves accumulated by Russians are in a certain way highly mobile. They are such that they can be quickly used in any area. But how it will be depends on what we will be like. If weakness is given, the reserve will be abandoned. If not, then it will not be. Currently, everything looks like this. That they cannot find a weak point in the defense of the third bridge, although they are trying very hard and suffering incredible losses along the way, the military man noted. Speaking about Russia's losses, Volokov emphasized that this should be assessed from the point of view of ratio. There is an absolute number and an absolute percentage of our losses and a percentage of their possibility. Therefore, we reach a ratio that exceeds 10 to 1, so that for one of our wounded, there are 10 of their wounded, more than 10. Sometimes it reaches 20 to 30. Relatively dead, the same, said the unit commander. Fire has occurred in a warehouse of rubber shoes in Lubim city in Yaroslavsky district of Russia's Yaroslav region, Russian TASS news agency reported on Thursday, with reference to the press service of the Ministry of Emergency Situations. Later, the press service reported that the fire was contained to an area of 5,000 square meters. The roof of the warehouse has partially collapsed due to the fire. No casualties have been reported so far. Some 40 firefighters and 12 pieces of equipment have been dispatched to the site of the incident to extinguish the fire. Meanwhile, Ukrainian Telegram Channel reported that a construction materials market was burning in Moscow region, without giving further details. Earlier, Local media reported fire in the building where the Ministry of Internal Affairs Supply Resources Storage Base is located in Rostov-on-Don city in Rostov region. Устанавливайте 246 на...